What's going on, here, squad? It's your main man, Hitman, and I am back once again with the daily spawn updates for Red Dead Redemption 2 Online. This is for the family heirlooms, all our jewelry, the coins, the arrowheads, the flowers, the antique alcohol bottles, all tarot cards, the bird eggs, and the fossils. Today is Friday, May 14th. And as I say each and every video, smash that thumbs up button if you find this video any bit informative or helpful in any type of way. And if you're watching, just browsing, just checking out the channel, just checking out the cycles, just checking out me in general, make sure you guys subscribe and hit that notification bell so you guys can get each and every video that I put out because I put out videos each and every day. Um... If you guys want to know Madame Nazar's location any bit earlier than this video, be sure to follow me on Instagram and Twitter at HitmanMiyagiYT. How to spell that will be in the hashtag below the video near the views and stuff like that. The likes and views and stuff. It's a hashtag right there. And down in the description box below. Which you should always check on this channel because, or at least during these videos, because there are things down there. Like the cycles are written out down there. The There's a link to a video for the current cycle of fossils. So I can help you guys find those. And the Twitter and Instagram for the channel. Anywho, first things first. Let's get to Madame Nazar's location. Which she's in a different spot today. Which is an okay spot with me as well. She's over here in Manzanita Post. Area. She's right around the bend from the fast travel of Manzanita Post, which you should spawn around this area somewhere near this house. You should spawn around here somewhere. When you do, just take this road down and around, and she's right there. She will be here until 2 a.m. That's Eastern Standard Time, New York Time Zone, East Coast Time Zone, for those of you who don't know, and or, and or not of America. How I personally get to her is just how I told you guys. I fast travel to Manzanita Post and take that road right around the bend. And she's right there. Super close, super easy. Or just be a savage and go straight through the woods and, <laughs> you know, do a little beeline. But either way, she's easy, easy to get to. The second thing is the Caribbean Rum Antique Alcohol Bottle, which is still in the same area. You can technically run here from this in this from Manzalita Post or Madame Nazara's location. The Caribbean Rum Antique Alcohol Bottle is right here in Blackwater today. Inside this tent towards the back, I think it's on some crates or a barrel right here in the back of this tent. So go get that as well. Let's go over here to where we normally do business, which is the Lemoyne area of the map. Right over here. The cycles for today, Friday, May 14th, are Family Heirloom Cycle 4, Our Lost Jury Cycle 4, Coin Cycle 5, Arrowhead Cycle 4, Wildflower Cycle 4, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 4, All Tarot Card Cycle 5, Bird Egg Cycle 4, and Fossil Cycle 4. Remember to check the description box below because that's written down down there. Just in case you didn't get which ones was which. It's all down there for you guys. There's the cycles, a link to a video for the current cycle of fossils, and how to spell the Twitter and Instagram for the channel. Let's get to some of these things that we will find across the map. The Lemoyne area of the map. Which I want to get to a couple that's kind of higher than my current markers. Which there's one up here, which is a coin. This is a random coin. I cannot tell you guys exactly what coin you will get. But make sure you pay attention to these markings on the map. Because it will help you, I mean, indicate exactly where these things are. Right here at this location, under a clothesline. Or in the middle of a clothesline, you will get a random coin right here at this area. Let's go down to another location, which is a card. This card is right here on a barrel 
inside this ruined house or burned down house. This card is a Ten of Wands. There's also a card inside this house on the dinner table, which is a Nine of Wands. One more thing is like right about here, come over here with your metal detector and you guys will get a random fossil right here at this location or around this location. Come over here with your metal detector. You should be able to indicate exactly where it is. Let's go to our first marker, which mm, let's go to this one right here. Right here, this location right next to the word okay. Inside this L-shaped building, you guys will get a goat hair brush. This goat hair brush is at the back of the shack, right here on a bench. It's more like right here, right about there, inside the shack on a bench. You will get gold hairbrush which is a family heirloom let's go over to our left a little bit more at our next marker which is on this little crab hand cloth thing right here at this location you guys will get a random coin another random coin right here super close to it to this square right here this square is a i guess a stillery or whatever a moonshine camp or whatever but right here super close to it Come over with your metal detector, and that's what you will get a coin. Uh, if you cross the water right about here, you guys will get a uh, a random arrowhead if you want to go and get that as well. Let's go down a little bit to our next marker, which is a another random fossil. This random fossil uh, is right a along the coastline. Remember to look around trees and I mean like uh, like tree stumps and stuff like that around this location or any location where there are fossils and stuff and it'll help you out indicate you know exactly where things are. But come over here in this area with your metal detector and that's what you will get a random fossil. Let's go over to the left a little bit more. Let's go right here to this marker right here. Right here at this marker, you guys will get a heron egg, H-E-R-O-N. It's in a tree, shoot it down with a varmint rifle or a bow using a small game arrow. Right here at this location, remember to look up in the tree. Let's go to our next marker, which is above the E of Lemoyne. Right here at this location, you guys will get a random coin. This random coin is underneath the bridge at this location. Come underneath the bridge with your metal detector. And that's what you will get a random coin. There's also a tarot card right here inside this gazebo, which is a six of wands. So come over. Once you go over here, use your eagle eye and look in this direction. You should be able to see it if the trees and stuff aren't in the way. But there is a tarot card right there on the sitting area of the gazebo. Let's go over to the cemetery, right inside the cemetery. At this location, you guys will get right here inside this um, crypt. You guys will get a Benais Topaz ring, B-A-N-A-I-S. It's right here inside this crypt. Go towards the back. Through the gate and towards the back right here at this location. And that's what you will get or pick up. And that is a lost jury, by the way. Right here at our next marker, in front of this church, on a bench, you guys will get a ten of pentacles. Let's go down to our next marker, which is a family heirloom. This family heirloom is a ivory hairpin. This ivory hairpin is on the table. On the other side of this brick wall, there's a little gate right, right about here, and it's about here. It's like a, a, a metal table right up on the other side of that gate. Let's go over to our next marker, which is another family heirloom. This family heirloom is a cherry wood comb. This cherry wood comb is on the table in this backyard. It's like outside patio furniture, white patio furniture in this backyard and right on that table you will find your cherry wood comb which once again is a 
family heirloom. Let's go down to our next marker, which is underground. This marker is a antique alcohol bottle, and this antique alcohol bottle is a Tennessee whiskey bottle. It's on a crate in the middle of the tunnel, kind of over to your right a little bit, but how you get to that crate is go through these two gates. There's a platform here, jump on top of that. There should be an entrance about here. Go down, go through the entrance. It should lead you down and around to the bottle that's on the top of a crate. Grab the bottle and reverse to get out. Uh, let's go over to our next marker, which is the cardinal flower that spawns over here in the area. In this area, each and every day, that helps me personally indicate exactly what flower or what cycle the flowers are on for the day. Um, let's zoom in on that just in case you don't see exactly where that is. <laughs> right here at our next location, or our next, the location of our next marker is a arrowhead, a random arrowhead. Come over here. There's a large tree. Come over here with your metal detector around the base of that tree. And that's what you will get a random arrowhead. There's a couple extras that I wanted to tell you guys about, like, um, down here next to the stranger mission or whatever i didn't go to this guy i dislike doing these missions i think i did do them on my first account but this account that i do these videos on is not my first it's like my second or third account but there's a coin right here next to this big tree outside this stranger's house so go get that and there's also a family heirloom there's a card about here. It's on a crate on this side of the building. That tarot card is a three of cups. And right about here inside the house, on the second floor, there's a jade hairpin on top of the fireplace. The first room to the left as you go in the house and up the stairs. As soon as you get to the stair, the first room to the left on top of the fireplace that's will be a jade hairpin um, there's not much in roads today there's a couple uh, tear cards for you guys which there's one inside this barn right here this tear card is a two of pentacles and there's one over here on this hanging platform right here at this location and you that is a three of swords there's also a lost jury right here. Come over with your metal detector near this large rock that's in this area. And that's what you will get a lost jury. I have a couple more things for you guys. Which one is a tarot card that's right here behind the house, the Southfield Flats house. There's a wagon back here. And on that wagon, you guys will get a six of pentacles and over here inside this house in the chest that's in one of the bedrooms you guys will get a new guinea rosewood airbrush that's pretty much it that i have for you guys if i do go live i'll show you more i'll try to do more go find more things because a lot of this stuff i'm full on and i don't really want to uh sell it to Madame Nazar yet like I just want to see how much I can collect and all that other stuff so if I do I'll try to do more so make sure you guys look out for my live streams that's if I live stream this I've been playing Destiny so I may go live playing Destiny just to add content to the channel give you guys or something to watch or you know new subscribers something to watch maybe they play Destiny 2 and I'm doing something that they need to look at. <laughs> but the cycles for today, once again, are Family Heirloom Cycle 4, All Lost Jewelry Cycle 4, Coin Cycle 5, Arrowhead Cycle 4, Wildflower Cycle 4, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 4, All Tech Art Cycle 5, Bird Egg Cycle 4, and Fossil Cycle 4. Once again, I'm going to do this different. Coins and Tarot Cards are Cycle 5, Family Heirlooms, Lost Jury, 
Arrowheads, wildflowers, antique alcohol bottles, bird eggs, and flowers are all cycle four. <laughs> I hope you guys got that. If not, check the description box below because everything is written out down there. Along with the a link to a video for the current cycle of fossils and how to spell the Twitter and Instagram that I have for the channel. Just in case you guys need to know Madame Nazara's location and or any other information for the channel. I do post a link to this video and all kinds of other stuff. So, Or that's basically it. <laughs> but... Thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for liking, sharing, commenting, and anything else. If you have any tips for me as a new YouTuber, let me know. Comment down below. Anything else if you guys have any games that I you suggest that I should get that you think people want to see or you want to see, let me know in the description. I mean, the comment bo box below, comment section below. Um, yeah. Shemaine and Hitman, remember to like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell just in case uh, you don't get each and every video that I do put out. So you can get it each and every video that I do put out because I do put out videos each and every day. Sometimes too, if I do go live. It's Shemaine and Hitman for the 30th time in this video. And I'm out.